What's up guys, it's Underworld Times with another story. Four New South Wales men have been charged under AFP Operation Ironside as being part of a syndicate responsible for trafficking and importing methamphetamine with 461 kilograms of methamphetamine having been seized. In April 2021, the Australian Federal Police commenced an investigation targeting a transnational serious and organised crime syndicate involved in the importation and trafficking of drugs. On the 12th of May 2021, following intelligence from Operation Ironside, AFP officers, with the assistance of New South Wales Police, Force, Drug and Firearm Squad, executed a search warrant at a property in Doylson, New South Wales. During the search warrant, AFP forensics located a compartment hidden beneath the tray of an unregistered truck located on the property. Inside the compartment, police located several bags containing approximately 20 kilograms of methamphetamine. The next day, on the 13th of May 2021, police executed a search warrant at a premises in Seven Hills, New South Wales, where police located two large duffel bags containing approximately 23 kilograms of methamphetamine hidden in a reef cavity. Following the execution of the search warrants, a 36-year-old Roselands man and a 35-year-old Central Coast man were arrested and charged with the following. Trafficking a commercial quantity of controlled drugs, namely methamphetamine, with a maximum penalty of life imprisonment. The men are next due to appear at Central Local Court on the 4th of August 2021. As part of Operation Ironside investigations, police uncovered a number of interconnected syndicates allegedly linked to the trafficking and importation of methamphetamine. On the 7th of June 2021, a 39-year-old Bardia man was arrested and suspected of being the onshore controller of a criminal syndicate in Australia. He was charged with allegedly directing activities of a criminal organisation and importing a commercial quantity of a border controlled drug. Police will allege this same man was also part of a separate syndicate organising to import a further 418 kilograms of methamphetamine into Australia. On the 5th of June 2021, a consignment allegedly organised by the syndicate arrived via a freight ship into Brisbane, where it was examined by AFP and Australian Border Force. The consignment consisted of a hydraulic press and a large industrial gearbox. An examination of the gearbox found 96 individual packages containing a white substance which tested positive for methamphetamine. The total approximate weight of the packages was 195 kilograms. An examination of the hydraulic press revealed 52 individual packages of a similar substance with a total weight of approximately 223 kilograms. The total weight of the methamphetamine concealed in both items was approximately 418 kilograms. As a result of further investigations into the alleged organisers of the import, police executed a search warrant at a premises in Arena Heights on the New South Wales Central Coast on the 7th of June 2021. Police located and seized approximately $47,000 in cash, including $40,000 hidden inside a shoebox in a wardrobe. Following the search warrant, a 37-year-old Arena Heights man was arrested and charged with the following. Entering into an agreement to import a substance, the substance being a border controlled drug, namely methamphetamine, and the quantity imported being a commercial quantity. The maximum penalty is life imprisonment. The 39-year-old man from Bardia, who had previously been arrested, was charged with the same. The men are next due to appear at Central Local Court on the 4th of August 2021. 
AFP Detective Acting Inspector Luke Wilson said Operation Ironside has prevented a significant amount of illicit drugs from entering Australia and damaging the community. The AFP has been successful in keeping these drugs off the street through the continued collaborations with our partners. Queensland ABF Acting Regional Commander Joanne Churchill praised the joint agency collaboration, which included the comprehensive detection, expertise and skills of ABF officers. Our officers are highly trained to detect illegal import attempts. They work very closely with our partner agencies such as the AFP to ensure we are combating the scourge of illegal drugs and the harm it poses to the Australian community, Acting Regional Commander Churchill said. New South Wales Police Force Drug and Firearm Squad Commander Detective Superintendent John Watson said police will continue to target those involved in the drug supply on all levels across the state. These investigations highlight the benefits of our interagency collaboration which combine the strengths of law enforcement and work towards safeguarding the community.